Damn. Okay, Electro. Electro coming at you. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who done did it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. I I What's up y'all, it's your boy Leandum, some coolest of African Geek, welcome to my channel, I'm watching Jupiter's Legacy right now on episode 6, show is phenomenal, previous episode we dealt with the uh, whole ramification of Utopian's morality, what he believes everybody should, ah, uh, let me put it this way, the way he believes everybody should act because of how he believes the world should be black and white and we got introduced to a new villain which i thought it was his therapist the whole time which I, i'm pretty sure was intentional and chloe and george are now george's son i mean i know you know a thing you know legacies for from your for from being uh utopian's wingman to now his son banging his daughter <laughs> how the ties have turned brandon is also trying to figure out what his moral uh priorities are um utopian conflict with his wife daughter son brother like there's so many different moving pieces in the show right now plus we in the past they go to some mysterious island starting to move along there's three more episodes to go but like it's probably going to end with the final episode where they're going to give us a specific episode for the flashback of how they got their power maybe we'll see I, i'm just throwing up weird ideas right now but this is episode six let's dive right in you know what i'm saying Ooh, the past two episodes have been sexing after sexing What is he hearing? He hears Comet from Mars and he stops. This is just normal life for them. At least they good now. This is the mother's episode. The showrunner is basically like, here's this character we've been sidelining for the past five episodes. Enjoy. Damn, Sky Fox was popular. Man, they still trying to convince people. Man, get to the island already. <laughs> I know I'm getting upset. The payoff has to be huge. But I feel like I know the payoff is superpowers. <laughs> so I just got a gun? Look at her pulling her lowest lane on. The lack of information Samson is giving them makes me think they'll probably not happy to get powers. Oh, were they? <laughs> She's so curious. Hey, Ruby's back. Damn, they really got him grounded and shit. They got a lot of flying shots in this episode. George, the best wing man. Damn, more of them dying? Yo, there's so much conflict now in the superhero land. Now I'm even sure it's gonna be like a new hero versus old hero. Maybe hero ways. They really got time to make everybody's costumes look pretty decent, actually. You are the only two who know who don't know anything. They just hang around prisons, or they were just handing off that dude. She didn't even know. Why do I feel like she's gonna die? I always feel like people are gonna die in this. Not the mother, the friend, Chloe's friend. Uh, I am so Why are they all freaking out? He just yelled. <laughs> I know he's losing it, but he just yelled in that moment for them to look at him like he crazy. <laughs> Listen to the black man. He knows what he's doing. They legit just been doing this since how many days ago? <laughs> In this world, is she still getting high though? I thought her mother was gonna show up while they still getting freaky. 
classic conversation through the window. You know, it's normal stuff in this world. Another flower shot. <laughs> it's my home. It's a new world. It's all about him taking a life. What about the lives lost? Like I'm trying to understand how did they get together from this, from her being so distrusting of him. It can happen in the shithole of years. <laughs> Damn. Oh boy can draw. Look at how they scared of him. How did they end up being so cordial? Because they got superpowers? Yo. No. Looks what? like history repeating itself. Here's the storm. Yes, you oh. Are. You are How did they know he lost his shit like this and still let him be the leader of the group? Damn, man. They build another conflict to make them take more time going to the island. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> Damn, that wasn't a graceful landing. Why is she sneaking in? Is it the mother just gonna die? I feel like somebody's gonna die and really create that conflict between hero and villain. I mean hero, old ways and new ways of the hero code. Oh, I was right, she is the one who died. I was right, she is the one who died. I knew it. Damn, her intestines are out. Yo, did she die because she... Oh my god. I knew she was gonna die. Why am I so happy? I just, I'm just happy because I'm predicting the show, not that she died. Is the mother gonna kill? Damn. Okay, Electro. Electro coming at you. I'm picturing the Mark Webb Electro score for Jamie Foxx. You lie to me, you die to me. Damn, she's smooth with it. She about to do the killing blow like Brandon. Ooh. Ooh, suplex. Damn. Oh, no, it wasn't a suplex. She just threw him against the wall. Damn. Did she kill him? Is he still alive? He he lives? Damn, I thought she crossed the line also. How's Chloe gonna react to her last friend dying? Is he only coming back from Mars now? Is she not gonna inform him of what just happened? She dead. She just joined the team. She did. Is that how they're going to end the episode? With a shooting star? Oh. He's going to shoot somebody. He's not going to shoot her. He snapped. They made it out the storm. Are we finally at the island? They all feeling it now. She's the first to see the island. Finally. <laughs> they found Skull Island. Finally. Yeah. This flashback storyline. <laughs> The biggest slow burn ever, man. Like I said, the payoff has to be so worth it. But the payoff is just superpowers. We already know they have. So I don't know how they're going to make this fulfilling. Like, goddamn. Are they trying to show us that they really worked hard to get these powers? Like, they were a struggle <laughs> for Utopian and the gang. It wasn't just like, ooh. Oops, we got powers now. God damn. This is 
<laughs> I've never seen an origin told this way. It's kind of like daunting to me, storytelling wise <laughs> and pacing wise. Anyway, but anyway, it's a great show still. <laughs> it's a great story still. Chloe and Hutch still going strong. The mother's losing faith in the code also. I knew that girl was going to die. Chloe's old friend. That was so obvious. I thought I was wrong for a second. I was like, is the mother going to die? But now nah, still, you know, the girl. I would, I don't even know her name, but she looked like she was going to die. She was too good and she believed in the code too much. Not to be the downfall of the code. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? Utopian was in Mars the whole time outside of the flashbacks. I mean, like, it was a great episode. I feel like it's going to get to a showdown of the old ways versus the new way of handling villains. You know, they kept on showing that prison. That prison was fire. The VFX in the show, phenomenal. The power sets. We saw Electro. Mm. Let me dive into the next episode. Two episodes away from finishing it. Like if you like my action, subscribe. If you're not subscribed, deuces.